Good, it's Kev with KevWestBeats.com here to do another tutorial on Reason. Actually, this is going to be on Reason 6 and Recycle 2.2, which was just released today. And what I'm going to show you how to do is essentially create your own groove templates in Reason. Um, groove templates for those that uh, are unaware. Uh, for, say, example, you have a drum loop, a drum break, or something, you love the feel of it. But a lot of people are just afraid to sample, like they're afraid of getting sued, they don't want to have to deal with the legal obligations of it, and you know that's fine. Um, use break, or break beats for their feeling, and then go get your sounds elsewhere. I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay, Right here, um, this is obviously Recycle 2.2, I have it installed. Um, not a whole lot of new features. Um, you can use the QWERTY keys to select your tools across the top, as you can see I'm doing now. Go in from a pointer, silence, or lock, and pencil tool. Um, that's a new look. They did add a slice at 1 16th feature, which I really, really like. Um, they, and they removed uh, vintage hardware um, file support. Um, so if you have, say, an S950 or something and you want to import the files into Recycle, that's not happening. Um, um, in 2.1 and prior, they did support Akai formats, MIDI command formats, and a couple others that I can't think of right now. Um, but anyway, on, on to the tutorial. Um, what's important here in, this, in doing these groove templates is number one, having a good loop, have a solid loop. And with having a solid loop, you also want to have a solid tempo. You need to know the bars and you need to know the tempo information because what you're essentially doing is using this loop to quantize anything that you want to quantize. So in this example I'm using Isaac Hayes Breakthrough, it's about 84 beats per minute and I slice down on every um, hit of the drums. So I have a perfect loop going. You see I have a perfect loop going and I saved it as a rex file and I'm going to take it over to Reason 6, and this also works on version 4, and um, anything version 4 and newer. Um, I'm going to take this to Reason 6 and show you how I make it work. Okay, now we're in Reason 6. And what I've done is I've imported my breakbeat, my drum loop. It's Isaac Hayes Breakthrough. This is also the same loop um, Jay-Z and Alicia Keys used on um, Empire State of Mind. And I'm going to import the loop into the Dr. Octorex. I'm going to turn off Enable Loop Playback, and I'm going to click Copy Loop to Track. I've already copied the loop to the track, so I'm not going to do that again. Okay, now we're down in the Reason Sequencer, and what I've done is I've um, converted the loop on the redrum from a repeating pattern to just a regular sequencer track, and I did that by right-clicking on the redrum, redrum pattern lane. I'll show you right here. And I went Copy Pattern to Track. Turned off Enable Pattern section, and I did the same thing on the Dr. Rex. Turned off Enable Loop Playback, copied Loop to Tracks. Then I go down here, right click, get Groove from Clip, mute the Sequencer track, go into the Regroup um, Mixer. Now I have a user template. I It's on channel A1. I assign my redrum channel to that and press play. I'm just going to turn it down just so you can hear the differences. See right now it's perfectly on beat. And now you feel it moving a little bit away, getting a little bit of that groove from the eyes of K's loop. And of course, if I want to shuffle it a little more, I can do that too. I didn't have the loop on. Or they can shuffle it a little bit. I can bring it back a little bit. You know, I can really play with the groove of, and I can really play with the groove of this loop that I've made. Um, so this, again, that's how you make groove templates, and this works with any drum loop. Uh, I like using break beats when I do it. I don't do it very often, but when I do do it, I prefer to use break beats um, just because I'm a break beat fan. And I, if I'm going to take the feel from a record, I'd rather do it with a break beat. Anyway, if you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for watching.